Meanwhile, Eugene Ahin says the president is deeply worried about the harsh economic conditions in the country and has assured Ghanaians of some relief very soon. Day in, day out, um, makes it clear that he knows and he understands everything that's going on with respect to um, the uncertainty within the economy and its effects and the effect it's having on, on, on all of us. I mean, um, during the tour of Ashanti, he made it clear that, yes, he knows um, there's difficulty and there's hardship everywhere, but um, he remains confident that um, sooner rather than later, these hardships would, 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 would go down. Um, if you look at what currently the, the raft of measures that are in place, for example, this um, collaboration, let me put it that way, with the International Monetary Fund and what it's doing, it's all geared towards ensuring that the difficulties subside a bit. And, and as you said, we are not the only people uh, or the country in the world who are going through um, these difficulties. Um, we, we came back from France about a couple of weeks ago when the president was honored with a, an honorary doctorate degree. And even in Paris, <laughs> you, you have queues for fuel. There are protests going on everywhere. And these are not um, indicative of, let me say, um, economic mismanagement on the part of government. No, but by what we all know, these twin events, the events of COVID-19 and what is happening with respect to the Russian invasion of Ukraine, it's having a rippling effect everywhere. So what I'm happy about is the fact that this government has not thrown its hands up in despair and um, allowing things to go um, 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 haywire. No. These uh, measures that have been put in place, I'm very, very confident that sooner rather than later, Ghanaians will begin to, to have um, a better um, feel of, of, of the economy and not one that is in, in, in disarray. But as I said, um, the president himself understands, he appreciates the difficulty Ghanaians are going through. And as he said all the time, sooner rather than later, um, we would see the effect of the um, policy measures that he's put in place, be able to assuage 